What is going on everyone? Leon checking in. And today I just wanted to talk quickly about why you may want to wait to get that Chromebook. So we're going to start things off by talking about October 5th and a lot of tech enthusiasts have their calendar marked for this very day because that's when the Google Pixel 2 is supposed to be released. But if we check into rumors, there is also supposed to be a smaller Google Home release and a Chromebook Pixel 3, supposedly. So if you want to check this out yourself, do a Google search of Chromebook Pixel 3 2017 or Chromebook Pixel 3 rumors, anything like that. And you should get some stuff coming back that goes all the way back to September last year and possibly even before that stating that a Chromebook Pixel 3 would be released third quarter this year. There's also been an interesting patent by Google. So there are some weird things going on here, but let's go over what the specs might be. So we're looking at possibly a 12.3 inch screen. We're looking for an upgrade in storage because a lot of the Chromebooks that are on the market today, they don't have a lot of storage. So if the Chromebook Pixel 3 comes out, you'll have the choice of either 32 gigabytes of internal storage or 128 gigabytes. And for those who don't know much about the Chromebooks, it kind of sounds like it's overblowing it. It's just for internet browsing, but we do have the Play Store apps. And I don't know about all of you, but I love to download a lot of games and I love to have my music on my device, my movies on my device. And I know a lot of uh, users are gonna be like, well, that's what the cloud is for. But for me, I like having that all on the device. That way if I gotta go somewhere, I don't have the internet connection, it's all there. Then we're looking at a nice eight gigs of RAM or 16, depending on what you wanna choose. And I think this is going to be great for multitasking, but also using the Play Store apps, especially gaming more on this. And, and that would be very nice to see, just make everything a little bit more smoother because again, a lot of Chromebooks are only coming with four gigs of RAM. And for those of you that love a stylus, there is supposed to be a Wacom stylus coming with this. And it should carry on the two-in-one factor. It should have a tablet mode as well. The only tough sell for the Chromebook Pixel 3 would be the price. And it's supposed to be going to start at $799. Now, I think for the average user, that's gonna be hard to justify because the average user is really only using a Chromebook for surfing the internet and maybe using a few apps. But I think for those who are looking for the increased RAM, the increased storage, and just a premium product, it's really not bad for $7.99, not at all. So in one of my recent videos, uh, my dog, he knocked my Chromebook off of the kitchen counter. I was thinking of possibly replacing this with a cheaper Chromebook for the time being, but I think I'm going to hold out. And I wanted to make this video because as for the Chromebook Pixel 3 rumors, there really doesn't seem to be a lot of word getting around. A lot of this hasn't been verified by Google. And I really wanted to share with people because I would hate for someone to go out, right? And you buy a brand new Chromebook, I mean, you think you're getting the best thing right now and you want the best thing. And then just a few weeks later, Google drops a Chromebook Pixel 3 that you wish you could have got. But you can't because you spent your money already. You may not be one of the first people getting it because you got to save a little bit more money, but you'll be jumping on it already. You'll be getting ready. Maybe you get one early next year if it does come out. So I'm going to go ahead and attach some of these articles in the description below. Do you think it's going to be coming out? Would you buy it? Leave a comment below, let me know. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you like it. If you have any questions or comments, leave those below. And until next time, Leon checking out.